What's a busy fella like me going to do when there's no time to cook? Should I get fish and chips and too greasy? What about Indian takeaway? No too heavy. Is this the answer? Sing for your supper and you'll get breakfast. Judith Hibbert swapped a career as a housing manager to run a cafe, serving up English takeaway suppers. She takes orders from busy workers at 8 in the morning and serves them fresh 8 hours later. It is difficult to find um, a good, wholesome, fresh evening meal. There's a pizza shop and an Indian restaurant and a Chinese restaurant, um, but nobody in Worcester was doing fresh meals made to order. Sonia Fordham's a hairdresser in Worcester and a gourmet on the go is steak and ale pie. By the time I get home it's like half six, seven and uh, she just re it's like real nice food and let me have a chance to go home and cook myself and it's usually chips or something at the time I do. Derek White is next with chicken stuffed with cheese wrapped in bacon. I've got a wife who cooks beautifully and she needs a night off. So how healthy is this English takeaway considering the cheese? We gave a nutritional therapist Judith's dish along with a supermarket ready meal with the same ingredients. Chicken does tend to be quite a, um, a bland meat um, and cheese does certainly liven it up a little bit. Yes, I think I would almost definitely go for this as long as I had a good lot of vegetables with it. And, and I do think that is a huge portion, so that would certainly, for my family, be, be enough for two people. You're probably only talking about maybe an ounce of cheese, which is probably less than you'd have on your average cheese sandwich. So really, that, that is healthy food. There's no queue outside the door just yet, but Judith's confident her supper service can fill that hole. Ben Godfrey, BBC Midlands Today, Worcester.